It's the big forehead gang. The big forehead gang. It's the big forehead gang. Now look, certified gang, I already know y'all finna be going crazy in the comments talking about like, hey, Keiko, your forehead big as hell, bro. You look like a completely different dude without your do-rag. But y'all been asking me for a little dread update, so here's the update, man. They're getting a little bit longer, you know, we got a little bit shakish to it. It's almost time to say goodbye to the Deweys and hats. We may have to slap a headband on there because Big Forehead Gang is in full effect. If you in the Big Forehead Gang, if you got a Big Forehead, let me know. Big Forehead Gang for life. What's good, Certified Gang? It's your boy, K-Co, and I'm back with another video, back with another banger, man. Welcome back to More Than Football. I hope each and every one of y'all having a good day. Another opportunity to get better and also to interact with y'all, show you guys some love, so it's always a good day this way, you feel me? I'm going to just cut to the chase, man. Y'all love the rating subscribers game day football cleats video. So I'm bringing back part two just like that, bro. We getting into the drip. Yes, sir. I honestly really like rating y'all cleats because it's kind of cool seeing what style y'all go for and everything like that. It kind of reminds me of like when I would watch like sneaker YouTubers and watching them like rate certain shoes and everything like that. Basically, if this is your first time watching this, this is how it works. All my subscribers send me pictures on Instagram of their cleats and I rate them on a scale of one to 10. 10 being, yeah, them is five, bro. Show them to everybody, you feel me? One being, yeah, never wear those again. Take those off and burn those. Just like I always say, just because you got some five cleats does not mean you're the best player in the world. Just because you may not got the most flashy cleats does not mean you're the worst player in the world, dog. This is just me showing love to my subscribers. So with that being said, let's get right into it. Rating my subscribers, game day football cleats part two. Let's get straight to it. I right, now, don't let my forehead distract you, man. We're going to start off with this certified gang member right here. And it looked like he got some Nike IDs, the 360s, man. And these are fire, bro. It's like, it looks like it's a navy blue, but it's kind of got that little iridescent, little sparkly, beautiful uh, shininess to it. And it says, Geo 33, baby. Okay, I see you on there. Nike ID that, John. I like the bottom of the cleats. It looks like it's a chrome silver, bro. These is definitely fire, bro. This is something I definitely would wear on field, bro. If I had a Rachel cleat on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give this one a 9. I'm going to give this one a 9.5 out of 10, bro. Sliding. We got this certified game member right here, and he's got the pink breast cancer awareness. Untouchable tools, man. These are fire flames, you feel me? You don't really see... A lot of people wearing like all pink cleats anymore. You feel me? Like this year in the NFL, I don't even think they did the breast cancer awareness. But anyways, bro, I told you about the Untouchable 2s. I don't really like how they feel on feet, but looks wise, they do look good, bro. I love the chrome pink on the bottom. I told y'all I kind of like all like solid color cleats. Like if it's one color all the way down, only difference on these is that, uh, that the Nike check is black. Uh, you know, if I had to rate these on a scale one to 10, I'm gonna give these a I'm getting these a 9 out of 10, bro. We starting off this video 5. Big sliding, bro. We got this certified gamer right here, and I love the Nike check on this John, bro. Look at the Nike check. It's got little teeth in them. Like, they about to ow, ow, eat you up. You feel me? But these are like some uh, D lineman cleats. Um, I guess linebackers could wear these as well. But it's got the chrome red underneath. And like I said, that Nike check is what... It's what really makes it go crazy, bro. Uh, I think these are, I don't know if these are the Alpha Menaces or like the Disha, I don't know, bro. Um, but these is five, bro, all red. Y'all know I love red. If I had to rate these on a scale one to 10, I'm gonna get these a nine too, bro. Big slider, we got this certified game member right here and oh! I gotta stand up for this one real quick. These right here is fire as hell, dog. Look at these, bro. These are like some Kanye West college dropout drawings, bro. Hopefully, these is really your cleats. Hopefully, you didn't just go on Google and search up some customized cleats and send them to me. But these are these are your cleats. Please let me know who customized these, bro, because I need some like this, bro. These are fire as hell, bro. I love the purple and how it goes into the light, like pinkish, orangish color, bro. And just a bear on it, bro. You can tell these are nice. The pink laces, and this is on a Nike Vapor Carbon 2014. This is like my favorite cleat of all time, bro. These are just straight broke the scale. 10 out of 10, dog. These go crazy. Next up, we got this certified gang member right here. And this cools us down a little bit, bro. These are uh the Nike, not the 360s, but these are like the, the lower version of these. Um, I thought about getting a pair of these because they only sell for like about 80, 90 bucks. Uh, but the black and white, you can never go wrong with black and white cleats, bro. Um, do I like these specifically? 
I mean, yeah, as a practice cleat and everything like that. But if I rate these on a scale of one to 10, I'm gonna give these a 6.5 out of 10, dog. Next up, we got another Vapor 360 right here. He got Yes Sir in the picture. It's white, and the Nike check is white and blue. Uh, basically, a, a simple colorway, but I like how you put the chrome on the bottom. I like how you put the chrome silver on the bottom. That really sets his cleat off, and plus the Nike uh, check as well. I like these a lot, you feel me? You can tell these are Nike ID as well. Better rate these on a scale of one to 10. I'm gonna give these a solid eight, eight out of 10. Next up, this certified gamer right here, and I think we seen these cleats last video, but this is somebody else. These are the yellow Nike Vapor Untouchable 3s. Um, I like these, I like these, I like the little, it's got like, maybe it's blue. Yeah, like little blue stitching within the cleat too. Um, yellow Nike check. Yellow laces, it's got a little blue in the little pull tab, little tongue thing. If I had to rate this on a scale of one to 10, I'm gonna give this one, uh, I'm gonna give this one a 7.5 out of 10. Uh oh, for all my Adidas fans out there, bro, we got the money cleats right here, bro. As you can see, it's got the little money emojis all over it, bro. I think these are the uh, ID07.0, 8.0, no, not 8, they're 7, definitely. 7 or 6. I'm not a huge fan of like an army green, but uh, this ain't too bad, you feel me? I like the gold on the cleat as well. Um, ID zeros are always good cleats. I, I tell you, bro, Nike and Adidas right there, neck and neck, bro. Better rate these on a scale of 1 to 10. I'm going to give these a 7.5 out of 10. Sliding, we got the other version of those cleats we saw earlier, bro. The white and black, and I kind of like these better than the black and white ones, uh, just because, like, like I said, bro, all white cleats go crazy, no matter how you do it. Uh, black Nike check on this, white laces, says vapor on the side. Very simple, bro. If I had to rate these on a scale of one to ten, I'm gonna give this a set. More Adidas Jones right here, and it was crazy is my homie Drake got these same exact cleats. These are the Adi Zero New Reigns or the 9.0s, like we call them. Um, I like the little designs within the cleat, but the bottom is where it's at, bro. It's like that chrome. Beautiful rainbow, taste of rainbow color on that John, bro. That is really, really beautiful. You know what I'm saying? Really made me shed a tear and cry. Better rate these on a scale of one to 10. I'm gonna give these about an 8.5 out of 10. Like it's a neutral cleat, but that bottom is where it goes crazy. Under Armour making a stand. Oh, these is customized Under Armour. I didn't even know Under Armour could have it where you could customize these Johns. But these is fire. It says Stewie on them. Stewie, okay. Number eight, I think it said. But I like the chrome bottom and I like how it's like that spider paint. Kind of looks like the galaxy, like beautiful stars in the galaxy out there and wide, you feel me? White laces. And I'm not gonna lie, bro. These Under Armour cleats, I do like these, bro. I do like these. Um, if I had to rate these on a scale of one to 10, I'm gonna give these a, I'm gonna give these a nine out of 10, bro. I would wear these cleats myself. Slide we got a little maroon and gold in there, man, on the ID Zero. I wanna see these on the 9.0s as well. Um, yeah, I like the maroon and I like the gold on the back. You feel me? It's kind of basic, but then kind of not at the same time. Uh, you can't go wrong with this, bro. If I had to rate these on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give these an 8.5 as well. We got some more custom Jones right here, bro. These is five, bro. They took an all-white 360, what it looks like, and they put the yellow and green, and they got the little paint drip like you just got out there. Okay, I see you. And I like the yellow sock liner. And then on the back, it shows like a bumblebee and then the A. So his school must be an A, and they must be the Bs. You feel me? Might sting your ass or something. You feel me? But I really like these. I will wear these myself, bro. Like I said, bro, if there's anybody out there that customizes cleats, let me know down below in the comments because I really want to have some custom cleats this upcoming season, bro. If I had to rate these on a scale 1 to 10, I'm going to get these a 10, bro. I really like these. Custom, custom, custom. It looks like, bro, the 360s, the all-white Johns, it looks like they're the perfect cleat to customize. But this one says Sasuke on there, you feel me? Naruto. I'll be the fifth Hokage. Believe it. You feel me? If y'all watch Naruto, y'all know what that is, bro. But it says never back down on the cleat, never give up. I really like this, bro. I really like this. I, I don't know what the other cleat says, but I like how it's the orange and the purple. Um, it looks like it's done well. That's the thing about custom cleats, bro. It's like, if they're not done well, it don't look right. But these are done well for sure. Um, if I had to rate these on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to get these a 9.5 out of 10. I wish they would have just did a little bit more, like, on the sock line or whatever, but they fire. Rawr, rawr, he got some tiger cleats right here. He told me that his school is the Tigers. That's why 
um, he got some cleats and he wasn't trying to be corny. I don't think that is corny, but uh, I don't know which version of Adidas they are. These are, they may be the, these may be the, I don't know, these, these may be like the seven, six point, I don't know, bro. But I like the tiger design on it, um, especially if it matches your school, it's cool. But it's basically a primarily all white cleat. If I had to rate this on a scale of one to 10, I'm gonna give you a, let me give you an 8.5. Keep it moving, man. This certified game member right here, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm not a huge fan of these cleats right here, bro. I don't like the little, what is that, alligator snake skin on it, and the fact that it's all white, and then the gold looks like it's all messed up, but I, I get it. You wore these cleats, so it's probably not looking how they used to look. Uh, so, uh, with that being said, if I had to rate your cleat on the scale of one to 10, I'm gonna give this one a 6.5 out of 10. Man. We got some more 360s right here. It looks like this was a very popular cleat this year. Um, white and red. This is a really cool colorway, bro. I really like how it's got the red sock liner on it, the red Nike check, and then the the, the cleat is primarily white. These ones are like one of the base cleats that you can buy on like dicks. If I had to rate these on scale one to 10, these are always gonna be solid. I say it, it depends how you put it with your with your drip, bro. I, I say this one's an 8.5 out of 10. Towing in my jaw, this is you feel me? We got some Jordan cleats right here, the Jordan 11 Low Columbia Jones, it look like, bro. And I like these, man. If y'all paid attention, I just bought the Jordan 11 Low Space Jams, bro. Haven't tried them out yet. I know you guys want a field test that will be coming soon. But I like these, bro. I like the blue bottoms on it. And I like how it's primarily white. And who does not like a Jordan 11, man? I grew up loving Jordan, but never could afford them. You feel me? Oh, that kind of rhyme, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, if I had to rate these on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give these a 9 out of 10, dog. Or 360s right here, bro. These are fire, bro. Black and orange. And low-key, this would go crazy with the Tigers drip that I that my semi-pro team that I play on, bro. Because we got a black and orange jersey. But I don't know what we're doing about jerseys this year. But anyways... I really like the orange sock liner. The Nike check is fire, and I like how you put the silver around it instead of putting black. That makes the Nike check pop out even more. So you're literally on your artistic side. You feel me? I see you. Um, I really like these. I'll rock these myself, bro. If I had to rate these on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to get these a 10 out of 10, bro. I really like these, John. Next cleat, we got this one right here. It looks like it was an all-black Adidas cleat, but they customized it. They self, they put a little orange, or that could be red. Put a little red and gray in there as well. Number 18 on that, John. It look like it says Mari on it. I like, I like how people make stuff their own, you feel me? And, you know, they take a regular cleat and make it their own. Vibe. Cause as far as customization-wise, like, it, this is nice, you feel me? It's cool. If I had to rate your cleat on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give this an 8. 8 out of 10. Next up, this certified game remember right here and um, I've seen these cleats before blue and white kind of like your basic cleat right here but you can never go wrong with this man sometimes I like simple cleats like this bro um you know I like the blue the blue really pops out off of that white if I had to rate these on a scale of one to ten I'm gonna get these a seven out of ten last cleat of the day we got some donkey doink doinkers right here the doinkers right here boy these is some older DDC cleats right here but I, I ain't trying to I ain't trying to make fun of you now. These look like the Adidas Lyman Jones. Um, you know, red and black ain't bad, you feel me? I like the red laces on these Jones. Um, if I had to rate these on a scale of one to 10, I'ma give these a six out of 10. Six out of 10. All right, Certified Gang, that wraps up rating my subscribers Game Day Football Cleats Part Two, man. Let me know if y'all need part three, bro. It's really cool seeing what y'all do with the cleats, man. Make sure you guys leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new, follow me on IG, and uh, I'm out, dog.